<laughs> I'm sorry. You know what? It's been a really tough week for me. I went to my therapist to get in touch with my inner child, and I found out it wasn't mine. <laughs> Man, I grew up in Jersey. I'm from Jersey, and I live here now. And this is one weird thing for me that I tell people I'm from Utah, and I always get the same response. They go, oh, people from Utah don't have a sense of humor. You know what? I know we have a sense of humor. I know we do, because we built a miniature golf fun center across from the state prison. It's freaking hysterical. <laughs> there were a lot of people who were like, we don't think that's very safe. I'm what, are you kidding me? That's incredibly safe. You think some psycho serial killer breaks out of the state prison, he's going to stick around and play around a putt-putt golf? <laughs> Well, this is what I do so during the day, man. I got daddy daycare duty, man. And I got into it in the, uh, the other day in a mall parking lot with a security guard because I parked in a handicapped parking space. I'm like, dude, I got a four year old, a four month old, a diaper bag the size of American tourist and luggage, and a fold up stroller in the trunk that's more complicated to figure out than a transformer toy. I have special needs too! <laughs> you can't watch a DVD now without seeing one of those little public service announcements playing in the front trying to dissuade people from downloading movies on the internet. They're like, you wouldn't shoplift. You wouldn't steal a car, so why would you download movies? You know what? Here's flash right Universal Pictures. I have shot with it. I've stolen a car. <laughs> I grew up in Jersey. That was my Eagle Project. I feel bad for those old people working at Walmart. I walk into Walmart at 11 o'clock at night, and I'm met by an 80-year-old greeter. I'm thinking, oh, it's way past their bedtime. <laughs> but I think some of them like to work there to work there. They like chasing people down the parking lot, checking those receipts. You see the old people guarding the doors, checking receipts on the way out? They don't mess around. They're like the Department of Homeland Security, only more effective. <laughs> bunch of those 80-year-old Walmart workers, drop them off right in the middle of Afghanistan, tell them Osama bin Laden has a receipt that needs to be checked, they find them! <laughs> oh, I gotta move things along, I gotta get home and check for new friend requests on my face. <laughs> I'm on that MySpace.com. I am MySpace.com slash John Moyer. And let me tell you something. When I was a kid, when I was in junior high, I never had as many people who wanted to be my friends as I do now who were in junior high. <laughs> There's some freaky people on that MySpace. There really are, man. I met a homeless guy on MySpace. <laughs> That's pretty much the only space he's got. <laughs> I see all these homeless people with big signs, I am homeless, we'll work for food. You know what, if I were homeless, I wouldn't work for food. I would work for things like bricks, lumber, aluminum siding. 